What's going on with you? Kruger's whipping out a wooden cock and you've got a fucking nipple tassel. What does it sound like? Everybody and welcome to Sounds Like, the only panel show that's all about rhyme. I'm the host of the show, Going For Broke. You know that it's dope. It's the humble GQ, the tumbleweed, it's Shuffle T. Joining me as always in Rhyme Square is the kiddie himself, spitting it well, but he's a bit of a melt. It's Jamie Bleach. How are you doing, buddy? You okay? Hi, we're both back. We can handle these rap greats crossing the pond. Why is it guys that don't rap reach the panel like they were backstage and followed them on? It's Simon Lomas, Lee and Bagnell, Pat Stay and Hollow the Don. Oh, wait, it's not. Oh, wait, it's not. I am wrong. Shouts to Kruger for hopping along. Hey! Please, have you got any, any rhymes to start us off with? These aren't for the points or anything. They just, they're just for funsies to get the brains ticking over. I do. So if I said the scheme was, the scheme was Marley and me, I've got three more on that scheme for Marley and me. What first one's quite hard. It's a radio head song. Uh, Karma Police. Come on. Yeah. Another bit of radio head. Right. He's in there. Second one is if you're carrying loads of weapons. Arm to the teeth. Hey, here he is. Here he is. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so arm to the teeth. Last one we've got is if you're very open with your emotions. A heart on your sleeve. Heart on your sleeve. Look at that. What do bad. Bad. <laughs> it's hard to believe. <laughs> so we've got some amazing guests with us today. So let's get on with the introductions. Um, he's the boy with the cutest face. Jumping on because our other guest was super late. It's the one and only Kruger, mate. Hey. Ooh, hey. Next person who's following on. He's released very promising songs. Loyalty over money is properly strong. It's a young man by the name of Hollow to Don. And my father's my mom. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, man? You good? Nah, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. You already know. Thank you for having me. No, thank you for coming on, man. We really you appreciate it. Ground with everything I say? It would be ideal. Okay. With a pair of high heels. <laughs> it might be a nice deal. Ooh. Okay, I got <laughs> we do have a live reel. And you can catch him doing stand up with a microphone stand. I'll be in the front row with a giant foam hand. Rhymes, he knows that. Puts them in his Ryman's notepad. It's Simon Lomas. Ooh. We're like a pinball machine in a way, aren't we? Oh. Yeah, a broken one. Oh, there's the cut. Yeah, keep them coming. <laughs> And insert introduction for Liam Bagnall. It's Liam Bagnall. Hey. Hey. How are you, all right? I got a single clap from both Simon and Jamie. All they did was. None of them were even men. Oh. Okay, round one is Rhymes in the Wild. This is where each contestant is charged with finding two items that make the best rhymes they can in real life from around their homes or wherever they are. Please, can you give us an example, please? I can indeed. Here we go. I have these fellas. So I have uh, some fragranced pedal bin bags. <laughs> Why are they fragranced? What the fuck? Is that a yeah, So fragranced pedal bin bags. Yeah. And this is my favourite metal pin badge. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do I have your word that that's your favourite? Because that's an opinion. <laughs> my favourite. My absolute right. favourite. Right, Bleeze and I are going to rank them from first to worst. First place gets four points, second best gets three, and so on. And then we'll collate them all for a team total. Okay, so... Uh, Kruger, thank you as always for returning to the show. We're very glad to have you on. You're a good boy with a hell of a soul, and I've got a lot of time for you. What's your rhyme in the wild then, Krugs? I was going for this first, so like, guess who? Yeah, very good. I'm death proof. Oh, okay. nice. Okay, nice. But then I thought that's a bit simple, so I thought I'd extend it. So I do guess who identify the mystery face. Yeah, Jeff very good. Might check inside. 
as a dick in the case. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, get to identify the mystery face. Get death proof. Mic check inside. A dick in the case. Brilliant. Right. What What is that item? Sorry. What is that little? Is it dick? Yeah. Is it a dick? What is it? It's not a little dick. But what is it? Wooden? Is it? What well, I don't. He's got it's wood. That's what he's saying. It's a wooden. It's a little wooden <laughs> dick. Who Who gifted that to you? Uh, that's actually from Thailand. You gave it to me. Liam gave it to me. He bought. No, me I didn't give it to me. No, right. Liam gave. Oh, I actually did. I actually did. Liam gave it you was... his dick. No, he your dick no. in Thailand. Me and Fred in Thailand. went to Thailand and yeah. I bought him a key. Bagnall gave you. There you go. Dick. This little fellow. I thought it was funny. Now it looks weird. Well, it's erotic. Is you know, if nothing else. <laughs> well, it wasn't meant to be erotic. It was meant to be funny. Okay. Well, next up, yeah. we have Hollow to Don. Hollow, mate. Great to chat to you properly. Um. What what's been what's been happening, mate? What's been happening in your life? Give us an update. Doesn't have to rhyme. Also, oh, so I thought it was time for me to pick two items. You two can, items well, you can do either, either either way around you want. You can do the items now, or you can give us the update first and think about yeah, the items. The items I had them in the garage. Okay, so I got I got a leaf blower. Woo! Yeah, that's good. And and. <laughs> A cheap stroller. Oh! <laughs> All the fucking items that are in there. Why is there a stroller? It's a cheap stroller as well. That was I have no explanations for anything that happened. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Simon Loma. Simon, you're 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 an absolute fucking nobody in this world. Nobody knows you or respects you. Who even are you? <laughs> Disrespect. I'm a, a stand-up comedian. What's your rhyme in the world, uh, mate? <laughs> so I've been uh, I've been reading quite a lot in lockdown. So I've got a couple of novels for you. Okay. I've got in cold blood. Yeah, in cold blood. And this big old book. <laughs> right, okay. Yeah. Blood. I can hear it in your accent. Okay. <laughs> Has anyone ever told you, Simon, you sound like salad fingers? Yeah. I think everyone who's ever met him <laughs> said that, actually. Right. Might be one of those everyone who's ever met him ones. All right. Uh, <laughs> thanks very much, Simon. And uh, and Bagnall. Yeah. Uh, we've had a slightly longer break between episodes than usual, and I was almost starting to miss your face, but having seen it in the cold light of day, I'm reminded of why I hate your stupid, pudgy, fucking ugly mug. Right. <laughs> What's your arm in the world, boy? Uh, I mean, it's been difficult for me to find one. Uh, I've been moving out. From, me and Freddie moved out. We've been best friends living together for, you know, two years and had to it's move great. out. But what yeah. was funny is I found loads of stuff that maybe we'd been into over lockdown and some stuff that I don't like. So the first thing I'd like to show you is something I hate is a bit of apple. It's a bit of apple. <laughs> it's a bit of, you know, I bite it, bite. but I hate it. Uh, and the other thing is um, a nip, a nipple tassel. <laughs> Get out! Oh, he definitely just wanted to show that off. <laughs> right, let's go. So I'll write that down. Shall I nipple, nipple? Bread and bags are back. What's going on? You got Kruger's whipping out a wooden cock, and you've got a fucking nipple tassel. <laughs> I've been up to a lot of things in yeah. lockdown. <laughs> Well, uh, okay, yeah, that's that's a good one. So, so all right, where, uh, what's, uh, okay, they found shit to show in their homes, but who's gonna be the winner though, Bleasy Boy, if you could start, mate, with last place? Fourth, I'm putting Bagnall. <laughs> that's mad. That right. took me a lot to do tonight. Yeah, I Bravery Awards is first, sure. 100%, so, yeah. For effort. Creative as well. It was just sure. bits. I thought the presentation nipple would have been reveal, just on, a little bit simple, to be fair. But it's okay. on nipple reveal, but yeah, go on. It is a little simple. Bit of, apple. Apple. Right yeah. this, yeah. bit of apple. Come on, mate. I'm third. I'm gonna put. Um, I'm gonna put Simon in third. Simon in third. All right. Impressed with his L though. I was. I was. I was shocked you went for an L. Do you know what I mean? But then uh, second, I'm gonna put Hollow. First, I'm gonna put Kruger. Robbery. <laughs> Well, it wasn't Robbie at the end, but... Now, as we go through this week's episode, 
We're going to be monitoring Twitter as well because we have a challenge for everyone watching to work on as we go through this episode. Whomever can come up with the best rhyme for Simone Biles will be our multilinguist of the week. So get on Twitter and use the hashtag sounds like show and we'll be retweeting and we'll announce a winner at the end. But <laughs> we're now through to round two. <laughs> The quick fire rhyme game. This is where I will give a team a word or words and then a clue as to what rhymes with that word. You can't come up with just any rhyme. You have to get the one from the clue. So if the rhyme scheme was, I'd like to kiss it, mate, and the clue was adorable, the answer would be Simon's little face. So we're going to start with Bagnall and Kruger. Do you two have a team name? Um, we can't we've be Shadwell, Shadwell United, 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 and now we've you... moved out of Shadwell. Yeah. That's, that's a fucking... Uh, yeah, I feel I like your original good. name was Fred and Bags, wasn't it? No, we need to evolve. I think we need to... <laughs> Bags and Fred. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's the one. Bags <laughs> and Fred. We've evolved. That's, revolution, is it? that's, that's literally revolution. All right. And uh, some of these will be aimed at Pat Stay. All right. Three, two, one, go. Grim Reaper, mastermind behind unlawful activities. Skip. Skip. All right, fine. Skippy. Meet the Robinsons. Ice cream that comes with three separate flavors. Neapolitan. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I've got to stop doing that fucking sound. Armed and ready. Falling asleep at any time. Uh, narcolepsy. Ooh. Yeah, boy. All right. Window height. <laughs> As flatmates, what did Bagnall, Bagnall and Kruger used to have? Um, bingo night. <laughs> Not that, but I do quite like bingo nights. We have bingo nights, so that's a... No, come on. Bingo nights. That's true, though. All right, fine. You have bingo nights, then. All right, twisting my words. Rude hand gesture. Flipping the bird. Flipping the bird, like that, Bagnall. That's right. Pizza cutter. A spread made with nothing but nuts. Peanut butter. Bring me a drink. How did Bagnall look in the last episode? Uh, stinking rich. Bit of a prick. Bring me a drink. Four syllables. Bring me a drink. What were you wearing? Maybe that you might be wearing. No, pretty in pink. Pretty, pretty in, pink. in pink. He's got it on those clothes. <laughs> Signposted. Name another kind of nut or flavour. Uh, something roasted. Bear it. Dry roasted. Yeah, you got it, you got it, boy. You got it, well done. All right, pat on the back. A single man's home. A bachelor pad. Yes. Uh, Pat's done battles in Nova Scotia. Three mobile phone brands. Motorola. Pat's yeah. done battles. Pat's done battles in Nova Scotia. Samsung. Yeah. Ba battles in, is it? Oh, it's time, I'm afraid it is time. Oh, fuck. Please tell them what they missed. Tell them what they missed. You missed the first one. The Grim Reaper was the rhyme. Yeah. Was it? And it was Ringleader. Uh, okay. Yeah. Master yeah. Bind behind unlawful activities. The common yeah. phrase. Master Ringleader. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The window height. To be fair, bingo nights. I don't know what you guys get up to, but fair play. We play bingo all the time. Hello. Yeah, we do have bingo nights regularly. I'm just going give a point for that, but it was uh, it was pillow fights. Okay. I know, we never have pillow fights. We have no, bingo. we don't do that shit. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. You that. Place. If you're being accurate, we have bingo nights, no pillow fights. All right, move on. Yeah. And then the, the only other one was, uh, yeah, Pat's done battles in Nova Scotia. Samsung, Motorola. Apple. Apple. Yeah, uh, Pat's. Pat's done battles in Nova Scotia. Samsung, Apple, and Motorola. Yeah, but no one's like, oh, I've got an Apple phone. It's an iPhone. That's the model. Yeah, but no one talks like that, bro. Model. You're talking shit, bro. No one's talking says model, buddy. Not, not brand. Simon and Hollow. Um, do you guys, do you, do you have a team name that you want to? United Nations. Oh. You happy with that? 
Uh, not really, no. Um, <laughs> what other ideas? What about hollow mass? Hollow mass? Yeah. No. All right, okay. <laughs> no, it's quiet storm, because he's quiet, and I'm going to bring the storm. Let's go, baby. Okay, okay. Happy Simon? All right, yeah, let's do it. We're going to start in three, two, one, go. Motion sensor. Not a fire alarm, but a... Smoke detector. Yes! Straight off the bat. Trick knee. Hollow to Dunn's first ever opponent on URL. He's gone, is he? <laughs> I think, because I got the first one right, I think he might have just felt a bit intimidated. It's possible, yeah. isn't it? It's freaked out by the, 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 the cock and the nipple tassel. Exactly, exactly. Like, what, what the fuck am I in for? Do you yeah. know what I mean? Can I go on Simon's team? <laughs> Switch team? <laughs> Yeah, actually, that's quite good. I like the idea of just battering fucking Bagnall all over the fucking place. <laughs> Can I have the chat on my team? Yeah, I don't see why not. Yeah. Okay, so... so... It's almost... It's all like Simon and the people, but <laughs> Bagnall and Kruger. Right. Why doesn't he get Queso Grande? Because... He messaged me. He did want to come on. He said thanks for mentioning it, but... I'll tell you what. Queso Grande ain't no Pat's day. <laughs> wow. Uh, oh. That is true. I feel like we need a, f a person on the team. No, it's just, it's, as far as the battle rap world is concerned, it's two complete fucking nobodies, yeah, that no cunt's ever heard of, just fucking willy-nilly rapping and rhyming. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. All right, go on then. There we go. Hey! Here, we go. <laughs> Here he is. Oh, my God. I reckon you... you I reckon it? you... Oh. I reckon you fucking like cancelled. You told Pat Stay, oh, it's a different thing, <laughs> mate. Don't worry. You got Hollow the Don's address and you said, cut the fucking wires. It cut it. Oh, oh, what are we going to do? Oh, there's Queso Grande. What are the chances? <laughs> I've invested everything I've had in that hit. So the hit's gone through. He's gone. He's dealt with. So, so. Um, can I just call my mum really quickly and just tell her I've made it and that's it? Just stop the press. You may. Oh, this is I've made, made it. it. Jesus. You may. It's great to finally meet you, Queso Grande. Thank you. Thank you for having me. It's, uh, this this is it now. This is my life complete. This is the act. There's no Oh, no. Hollow's back. It's okay. Uh, Cancel. Right. Tell him. <laughs> hey, ho. That's great. I'm sure you'll make those raps, mate. It's Queso Grande. But as Kruger said, it ain't no Pat's day. Thank you. Um, Queso, you look like every character from Line of Duty uh, <laughs> rolled into one. <laughs> I'm going to, I've, I've not actually seen it, so I'm just going to assume that's a compliment. Uh, he's also very accurate. Thank you very much. I think he looks like someone from Spandau Ballet. What is it? One of them Owens. Is it Mark Owen or something like that? <laughs> oh, I've never heard that. I used to get, I used to get no, Paul mate, Hollywood quite a lot. Oh, yeah, so, Paul yeah. Hollywood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I wish I looked like Paul Hollywood, so... Oh, sorry. What am I doing? Okay, so what's your rhyme in the world, mate? Um, right. <laughs> Hang on. Oh. <laughs> he's got one. I, yeah, uh, right. Give us what, one, one, one sec. Hang on. Oh, for fuck's queso! Why are you not more prepared? Queso, you might have your imagination a little bit for this one. I'm afraid. Sorry. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so I've got, I've got a GameCube. Ooh. Yeah. And I've got some suede shoes. Woo! Fine, 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 fine. fine. There's no nipple tassel. All right. No, so, I mean there are, but I mean I don't know where they were where they're ready for that. They're in the chair right. underneath the sink. That's where they always are. Right, okay. I'm not gonna reassess the the points. I'm just gonna leave it as it is. It's a good effort. Fair play to you. But where, where, where would he have got, please? For his so he can have it. Well he was beating bit of apple, I can tell you that for that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, okay. crazy. Presentation okay. is amazing. You got up to 20 seconds before Hollow left. So I'm going to continue on for 20 seconds. We've got one minute 40. So let's go. Comedy gold. Put everything into it. Body and soul. Yes. Okay. Texting. Simon, you won this festival. Pet fringe. Yes. Up for discussion. Pregnant. Bunny in the oven. Oh, okay. Open Water, Eminem's battle rap TV show. Vocal Slaughter. Huh? Yeah. Vocal Slaughter. No. Not vocal. Total Slaughter? Total yeah, Total Slaughter. slaughter. <laughs> Where'd you get that? Right, okay. Uh, Broken Promise, The White House. 
Oval Office. Yes! Right, a pizza party. US comedian. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Something okay, Hargreaves. So one moment, huh? Something Hargreaves. Uh, Rita Hargreaves. No. Yeah. no. I've seen it in the chat, Skip. No, All right, very nice of you. Oh, right. yeah. Shock tactics, Mr. Bombastic. Bombastic. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, Sesame Street's new writer is eating a starter. That is, Sesame Street's new writer is eating a starter. Three popular cocktails. Oh, shit, I don't drink. <laughs> Pina colada. Yeah. Sesame Street's new Sex writer. Sex on the beach. Sex on the beach. Yeah. Woo! So, new writer. A nude... Uh... Something lighter. Yeah. Screwdriver. 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 Yeah. Yes. Wow. Okay. I'm going to give you some extra time because you've right. Last last one. Wood pigeon. Glad to see you go. Good riddance. Good yeah. riddance. Excellent. Simon, you carried me there big time. Cheers, mate. Wow. That was great, man. You guys smashed it. Queso Grande. How is this for you? I mean, it must be like a, an absolute competition win, mustn't it? I mean, you must no. be really excited. Yeah, as, as as I said prior, this is this is this is it. This is the pinnacle of my of my career existence. Everything. That's um, ironic because this is the lowest point of mine. So <laughs> we're meeting in the middle in a way, aren't we? Right. I'm going to check on the hashtag sounds like show to see. You know what's what good? It means Queso can't win this one, so I'm going to say one. So was it Simone Biles? I'm going to go. I'm going to go for disowned child. Oh, Ooh! very good. Someone, someone has said a grown child. Nah, because I'm going for the Simone for the disowned child and yeah, they said yeah, a grown child is not a as grown good. child. Yeah, it's nice. What about so, immobile. I'll tell you what, I like a bit huh? of humble, but Timon is vile. Yeah. <laughs> I've, been, I've been redoing my patio and I've got a six stone tile. That's what. That's what Queso Grande said. Oh. Oh, I don't I know whether that's good news. For, for me or not. Right, Queso, you'd be very lucky to get on the show. Don't start. Yeah. <laughs> Simone Biles will go, go miles to in those trials, but ended with no smiles. It's quite bad. nice. They went for the the ear as well, Jamie. Okay, oh, okay. that's basically it. That's <laughs> all right. There's much fewer than normal because Queso's here, so that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll move on. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. Round three. Now, round three um, is called Count Up. I am going to give everybody 30 seconds to come up with a setup and punchline which has to rhyme in a classic line on a scheme we'll tell you twats in time. At the end of that 30 seconds, you're going to perform them for Blees to rank from first to worst, okay? So, Blees, what is the scheme that they're writing on today? Ace in the hole. You've got 30 seconds. Nice touch. Starting in three, two, one, go. Ace in the hole. Ace in the hole. Ace in the hole. Ace in your hole. <laughs> Ace in the hole. Frantically writing there, everyone. You see Simon Momus, his little pen scribbling about. His is going to be particularly short. Like and Queso Grande also going to come in very short. <laughs> Kruger looking like he's struggling as per usual. And Bagnall looking like a fucking cunt. All right, that's time. That's time, everyone. Hands up. Hands up. <laughs> Kruger, what did you get written? Ace in the hole. My name isn't Joel. No, it's not. My face has a mole. Does it? I've got a bit of muscle. I'm basically swole. <laughs> <laughs> basically swole. Right, okay. Right, okay. I'm going to put basically swole so I can remember that one. All right. Um, it is soul. Okay, so what did you get written? Right. <laughs> I'm in the fray in the fold, king of the underworld. I'm trading in souls. Got my hand on the wheel, and I'm taking control. Woo! Very good. Hey. Very good. Taking control. Underlined. All right, uh, Simon Lomas. What did you get written, please, bud? Yo. <laughs> Don't do that again. I'm not surprised that your mum stays on the dole. <laughs> I liked it. 
she likes it when I do a strip tease for her because she likes to have her face in my pole. <laughs> <laughs> Is that true? So, Extra uh, points if, you, if it's true. Yeah, it's all, it's all true. I won't say whose mum it's about, but... Um, <laughs> Very good, very good. All very, very different approaches so far, which is good. All right, Bagnall. Uh, okay, so I said Adam Chesses. He's the K in the so. He thinks Sam. he's taken my soul, but I've made more money than he's made on the doll. Can you can you say it again, but say Sam, which is his name, not Adam? No. <laughs> <laughs> I won't. Please, please break it down for us. We're all waiting. Did you rhyme? Is it K with the so without the L on that? So without yeah, he did, he did, he did, and he I called me Adam as well. He did call him Adam, yeah, which is my name. Less that's, yeah. that's not even directed at anyone. But it was K with the so. so. K with the soul. I don't know your name. You're new. I've said something <laughs> wrong. But I'm but gonna be your name on the poll with two L's of who's doing best. For Look. the for the K with the so, I'm gonna have to put your fourth back. I'm sorry. I agree. Man. Fuck you. And fuck every thing that you're about. L, every L that you've taken. <laughs> every... right, okay, what's next? Although I'm fucking impressed with Simon, I'm putting you third, man. Oh, I'm surprised by that. Very good. Explain. Very good. <laughs> Very good. Because you didn't have as much going on with the other guys. The, the other two above you had had more rhymes per square inch. Yeah, they're, they're professionals. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm very impressed with you. I'm very impressed with you. Yeah. He did well, bud, all right? Don't worry. Don't get it in. He's a good boy. I try, you know, I try my best. You're doing really well. I'm just thinking about my name isn't Joel. It's just like, it's it, obviously, it's perfect. Do you know what I mean? But it, it's, it, again, it's true as well. It, I, his name right. is not, I can prove that. I think Kruger can as well. His name is not Joel. I'm going to put Queso in second, Kruger in first. Okay. I think Kruger had four on it, to be fair. So he had more rhymes on it. <laughs> Round four. Now, this is always on a specific theme. And before you answer, you have to raise your hand and say, sounds like, and I will choose who gets to answer first. Now, last week, our theme was Olympic events. But what do we have this week, Bleasy Boy? We are doing rap groups. This rap week. groups. It's my favourite type of group. And it's my favourite arrangement in which rap can be delivered. So this is a real great, great round for me. What it means is that I'm going to go through 10 rhyme schemes one by one and the first person to shout out sounds like and raise their hand, I will pick you out and you can tell me which rap group rhymes with the scheme I've just given you. If you just shout it out, then you lose a point for you and your team member. So let's have a test trial. You're looking for a rap group that rhymes with shuffle and please. Sounds like. Go on, Simon Lomas. Uh, run DMC. Oh, he is. He's fucking smart. Yeah, yeah. Question one. I'm all set. Oh, so it sounds like oh, Google. Tribe called Quest. You're fucking right, you know. Boy. I was like in my in my head how bad I am. I was like Diplo set. <laughs> <laughs> is it my ghost yet? Diplo set. What is it? Oh yeah, she's got that. Double Jeopardy. That sounds like. Uh, okay, so. Public Enemy? Yes. Ooh, quite, sweet. quite correct. Public Enemy. Also, I got another MOP. <laughs> Unfortunately, no extra points will be issued, but very good. You could also uh, say. Yeah, I'm going to put a K there, so I know that's K so grande. Right, that's one. Also, okay. Kruger, if you, if you break down the run the M and C. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Run the M and C. Public Run the M and C. That was what they were originally going to call themselves. Run the M and C. That was going to be their individual. <laughs> right. South Park. Sounds like Kruger. Outcast. Correct. Woo! Correct. You do have to speak in my, or you do have to hear in my accent, I suppose, on that one. Um, there you go. All right. Uh, golden Ticket. I don't know this, this group myself. Golden Ticket. One of the best beats of all time. One of their songs. And that's Jamie Blee saying that, you know? Right, okay, the initials is what? Oh! Oh, Kruger! Yeah! Swollen D. 
Did sounds you... like. Yeah, it's swollen big dick. That's right. Sounds like know? Souls of Mischief. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. It doesn't it's... rhyme. It doesn't work. It's mischief. mischief. I, I say mischief. mischief. I say, I say Miss Chief. Chief. Souls of Miss Chief. Chief. Right, okay, John Keats. Sounds like Kruger, Mob Deep. Yeah. Uh, Queso and Simon, you're taking a moment to get out of the gate, but I know you boys are going to come through for me, all right? I know you're going to level out the playing field because it's a very close match, believe it or not. You're a lifesaver. You're a lifesaver. Oh, it sounds like uh, Kruger, naughty by nature. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This isn't designed for Simon in mind, I suppose, is one of the. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Shower drain. Sounds like Kruger again. House of Pain. Yeah. 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 Okay. All together. Sounds like uh, Queso. Salt and pepper. You're absolutely correct, mate. Yeah. Correct. Technically a duo, but still a, a group. A group. All right. Phone numbers hard to reach. Come on. Come on. Someone. Uh, it sounds like. Pagnol. Phone types and harmony. Oh yeah. Correct. Nice shuffle. I, I think you may have. Did you say the the third one? I don't know, mate. What was it? For next couple of days. Oh no, I didn't. I didn't. Oh, say it sounds that. like. It sounds like. Oh. NW. Oh, go on, Queso. Good Queso one. <laughs> Sorry, mate. I, I know. I noticed you. You skipped it by accident. Oh, that's Kruger. Yeah. What does it sound like? <laughs> sounds like a monkey to me. This is where we play round five of Sounds Like. It's hardly hard, it's just bar for bar. This is where we pit two players against each other to have a direct rhyme off on a scheme to rhyme by Blues and I. You'll be paired up with a minute and a half of uninterrupted back-to-back -back lines. If you can't continue, then you are disqualified. If you make it through to the one and a half minutes, then it'll be up to Blues to hear what you said and see who's clearly the best. So, who's going first, I hear you ask? Well, it's going to be the only matchup that was originally on the card, Simon versus Bagnall. So uh, what is their scheme for today, please, Mr. Blaze? Stand on your feet. Stand on your feet. Not only good advice and, and a good scheme, but also what you're going to have to just D-O, have to do. I want Bagnall to start this one, okay? Three, two, one. Well, I can tell he's got one ready, go. Simon, it's nice to meet you. I hear you're battling me. <laughs> Simon? Yeah, man. Uh, I heard you're quite lonely and you spend a lot of time whacking your meat. <laughs> I did tell you. Um, uh, so, I do spend a lot of time whacking my meat, but that's the only time that you'll rap on the beat. What, when, he, when you're wanking? That's the only time you Yeah, that's when he does it. Oh, right, okay. Oh, okay. That's fine. Okay. I'll take you away from yeah. that. That that beat is so sick. I uh, I'm always tapping my feet. <laughs> oh, it's feet again, but I don't hate it. Uh, oh, did, uh, have we had feet? Well, stand on your feet is what it started with, but it's yeah. James <laughs> I think uh, it's fine. I know that because you look like police. Your dad's on the beat. Right, beat again. Uh, Lamas. Um. Yeah, I know that. I said. Uh, I did say feet when we'd already had it, so I'm sorry, but uh, that's a repeat. <laughs> oh, oh, is that bad? Yeah. That's a repeat. You think you're funny, but you're not rich, rich because laughing is cheap. Laughing is it? You're not rich. Not reach. Reach. <laughs> As in nouveau reach. Okay. Um... Yeah, I don't really know what you're asking of me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right, this is um, going to be two minutes. I saw you dunking your own head into the toilet, asking, is that even deep? 
Strange. Strange behaviour. Um, I only dunked my head in the toilet because it had a magical seat. <laughs> Did you catch that on the camera screen? What? Did you catch that on the camera screen? The camera screen? No, I, I didn't. Why are you always uh, telling me that Adam's a G? Time, Adam's time, a t- time. Okay. He didn't even have a chance to rip speed. That was that was amazing. That was really good from from Simon. Um, some low so points. Good ones for that scheme, huh? There were so many good ones for that scheme as well. Well, they got them all. They got every single good one. There's none left. So I agree. Um, I agree. You know what is it? You dunked in the toilet and said, um, "Is that?" That's, that would have been in one of my rhyme lists for the day. Absolutely. In the rhyme challenge in the morning. Uh, camera screen, I think, was a, mm. a particular mm. low light, if there is such a <laughs> camera screen. <laughs> How do you normally say it, Bags, when you're talking to people? and you Because you're a cameraman, so you know about these things. So you go, yeah, I'm just going just gonna to try to focus the camera. And they go, what? Sorry, what? <laughs> I'm a cameraman. I think I know what a camera is. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's how I normally say it, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for Simon with that, with where that, that on repeat. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. Look at those guns. Give us those again, Simon. <laughs> oh, yeah. Them, yeah, Simon, we needed that because I'm not, I'm, I'm not being funny. I'm not being crew grammar, really. Oh, don't um, be you, so no. hard on yourself. Was, right? was... All right. So now we're gonna have. I mean, I personally have been looking forward to this match for quite a while. And I know that. Everyone in the uh, in the chat has been Bagnall has been bugging me saying, please, can we just produce it in some way that we can have Queso Grande versus Kruger? And I said, oh, I don't know if we can. I don't know if we have the money to get Queso Grande on. But <laughs> we managed to broker a deal. It's been negotiated. So pray silence, please. Two minutes on the clock. Um, so what's what's going to be their scheme for today, please? Come on, it better be a good one for this because this is a fucking ho- humdinger. Excited for it. It's, this is um, the scheme we're doing is penalty box. Penalty box. Can't wait to hear how this, uh, how these two titans of rap are gonna approach the words penalty box in round five. Off sounds like it all comes down to this. Kruger, I would like you to start, please, as the as the more seasoned veteran in this. Oh, barely by a smidge, but all right. You got two minutes on the clock, and three, two, one, go. Penalty box. Your your neck will get chopped, and I'll put your head in a box. I'm gonna step to the spot for that. Penalty shot. Oh, very good. What was the scheme again? I forget what it was. <laughs> All I can see, if I'm looking at you guys, it's like a kennel of dogs. <laughs> <laughs> the way I said that was weird. That sentence was off. Hey, this is forgettable. I think I'm suffering with memory loss. <laughs> oh, Suffering with memory, that's something I've never forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you can remember this because it's a memorable loss. <laughs> oh, we're only 40 seconds in. Oh. <laughs> yeah. 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 You ain't on the level. You're on the level with boss. I'm a descendant. <laughs> <laughs> what a weirdly framed sentence. <laughs> I'm divine. I'm like a descendant of God. Mm. <laughs> oh. Yeah. The, uh, if you were on the pitch and I'm sending them off. Mm. Clearly, you're in a regrettable spot. Mm. Whoa! <sighs> and back. I'll tell you what, today the weather was hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I get it, it was. It, it agrees. And what? <laughs> Come on, Krugs. I'm telling you what. <laughs> I've had it, uh, oh! Brain's gone to mush. I'm going to put him in the ground like a vegetable plot. Whoa! <laughs> um. Well, did you see what was left in the pot? <laughs> <laughs> now he has to yeah, figure but, out what it was. What was, yeah, it? What was left was a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I didn't check. I'm too busy getting that guap. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever the cost. Uh, <laughs> 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 What? <laughs> <laughs> time, time, time. Oh, that was <laughs> You couldn't even rhyme a sound. Please, what are you saying, mate? 
Do you know what's nice for that penalty? Yeah, penalty box. You got the, you could have the edge of the box and the penalty spot if you switch them up. Like that. Could do, could do. But who are you giving that round to, mate? That's what I want to see. I'm giving it to Queso. Quick, 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 quick. Yeah, well. it, man. Unbelievable yeah. scenes. I can now announce that Bags and Fred have 26 points, but Queso Lomas, Simon, have 31 points, oh my meaning God. that they are the winners of this week's episode <laughs> in the weirdest turnabout in, Turn sounds like history, but mm -hmm. congratulations to them. You win two middle fingers up from everyone else. Sounds well done, you've earned it. Um, now, before we finish, I'm just going to go through some of the suggestions on Twitter to see what everyone's got for uh, for Simone Biles. Uh, Should have got hollow back on remote dial. That's pretty good. Fun mm -hmm. fact, a phone dials are similar. They had to postpone finals for Simone Biles. I've got a shit mobile. It's brick phone style. <laughs> yeah, nice. Simone Biles will go miles in those trials, but ended up with no smiles. I mean, that's my favorite, if mm -hmm. I'm honest. Yeah, I agree with you. That is um, the abyssal stair, the abyssal stair, at the abyssal stair. So uh, we'll be in touch with you to give you a, uh, a free ticket for next episode. You are our multilinguist of the week. Congratulations. If anyone thinks they can do any better, then leave your rhyme in the comments uh, below uh, or on our Twitter, and we'll have a look through some of them on our next live show. But congratulations and thanks to everyone at home for watching. Thanks to our guests, Bagnall, Simon, Kruger, and Queso Grande, and Hollow Dadan, who did make it on for a bit. Thank you very much and good night. Mwah. What does it sound like?